Hi, Leo, getting ready to do your reading. Let's see what is going on for you. I am open for private readings at the moment. The link to my site is below. All right, what does Leo need to know at this time, Spirit? What is going on for Leo? First card out is the star card. It says, hard times are over. Look forward to an abundance of happiness, enthusiasm, and positivity. Listen and follow your intuition. I swear someone else got like the same combination. But listen to your inner, wish, inner wisdom, your intuition, because it'll give you the divine guidance you are needing at this time. And But know your limits, boundaries. Okay. I may need some help from someone else possibly or someone could come in and help you let's see what is going on for leo sun moon rising and venus honeymoon okay so honeymoon phase attending someone's wedding could be some traveling there you may be in a relationship where you are experiencing that you know happy honeymoon phase no it's not the right time with a water sign some of you there may be a hard no on a water sign Something is going in a cycle, something is ending, and something new is beginning, so move on. Someone is a distance, either someone is at a distance who's important, or someone is acting distant from you, or there may be an earth sign who's at a distance who may be the right choice for you, possibly. Distance, earth sign, one more. Letting go, making room for something new, letting go of an earth sign. Okay, so... This is very specific for someone watching. They're, they're telling somebody very specifically, no on a water sign, and either you need to let go of an earth sign or let go of an air sign to be with an earth sign who's at a distance, something like that. So again, very specific. Something here is, um, you may be doing some research on someone as well. You may find out maybe they are married now and on a honeymoon, but um, I think new love is coming in for you. I think some of you could be meeting somebody new okay all right let's see let's put these over here <clears throat> what is going on for leo sun moon rising and venus overall energy of the page of cups the world five of cups the seven of coins and the page of coins under the deck is the strength card i do feel like you're switching over here i feel like there is something that has ended and something new that is beginning I feel like you may be feeling sad or someone may be viewing you that way, but I feel like there's new love on the horizon with both of these showing up, page of cups or the page of coin. You could be, someone may, yeah, you have new love here. Okay, there's, yeah. So definitely look forward to new love, meeting somebody new. You could be asked out on a date here <clears throat> because it does say hard times are over. What is this, seven of coins, seven of wands, hidden position there's something i get a relationship a person that's just not going to work out it's like the logistics don't work it's just like the two of you can never be on the same page the timing is always wrong but even as i split the deck though i do see somebody new coming in for you what is this page of coin two of wands choosing someone new definitely maybe an earth sign for some of you a new a new earth sign or something nine of wands page of swords lovers Definitely could be somebody that you do know already who has their eye on you. So I'm kind of getting, to, there could be two people, someone brand new, and then someone that maybe you have met before and talked to who's also interested in you, Leo. So what is this three of cups? Nine of cups, being very happy. Ace of cups, wow. The full energy. Okay, so it might be a fire sign like you, or this is you. This energy here in the hidden... <clears throat> maybe a cancer that you just can't seem to get on the same page with this person. They may be traveling a lot or living at a distance. Yeah, this person may be juggling someone else or they just have a lot they got to take care of. So there's somebody who you kind of do have your heart set on and I hate to break it to you, but not for all of you, but for some of you, this is just not going to work out in your favor. And it's kind of, it's wasting your time is what I'm feeling. When you feel, I feel like you have two new offers or opportunities here. One could be a Gemini, but oops. Two things just fell out. The moon fell out in the seven of swords. So there's definitely something in this position here that's hidden from you that you don't know. If it's a Pisces, definitely they're, they're hiding things from you. They're secrets. They're not taking action. Five of swords. 
Five of coins. I think, <coughs> excuse me. <coughs> You've been going through some changes with these fives. It's been difficult. But I think you're going to get some news with the Ace of Swords. It's going to make, um, it's going to give you a little more clarity about what to do next in your love life. So, <coughs> I'm sorry, I'm going to have to get some tea. Yeah, I see some, I see much better for you guys coming in. Okay, and again, one of them is at least new that you haven't met. So if you're like, well, I don't want anybody from my past. I'm not looking, you know, these can be, this can be a brand new person. I have an Aries possibly for some of you or a Sagittarius. Who's this person over here? Pop out. Nope, I can feel, I feel when they get like clustered, they get tighter and they're not going to come out. All right, so I'm going to switch to this one. For some of you, you have a person who may have an E in their name. Their name may start with an E, like Eric or something, an Aquarius, and then W. So I think W's been coming out a lot lately. Could be first name, last name, something significant about the person. All right. What is going on for Leo? Flirt. So they want you to flirt. It says, extend your lighthearted energy to others. Yeah, I feel like, again, it's kind of like this energy of, like, you can only take so much, you can only wait so long, and it's kind of like, it's, okay, that's enough, I'm done. You know what I mean? Like, let's move on, and someone else is definitely waiting, but let's see, what is, it says the cross, the crossing, initiation, so something new, initiating something new, overwhelm and plenty, that's kind of like the, um, could be like the Ace of Cups, the Nine of Cups, your cup runneth over type of energy and movement toward adventure spirit of the river so i do see things moving for you leo you're not going to stay stuck forever you're not going to be waiting for this person forever something new is coming in let me go to a different deck though here what do you need to know what does leo need to know the lady Okay, that's too many. Okay, definitely came out by itself. So I'm going to take that one and put the rest away. So there could be a gift coming in with the bouquet. You could be receiving a gift. Just notice how she's smelling the flower right here. Moving forward with the ship. Someone could be traveling toward you. Thank you. I forgot lilies. Yeah, I guess someone's coming towards you who would be much kinder, who may give you gifts. They may be moving or traveling right now, but I get that it's okay because I feel like they're coming closer to you. I don't know if you can hear the gardeners outside, but <clears throat> I apologize. They'll be moving quickly. Let's see, Knight of Wands, Eight of Swords, the Knight of Swords, and the Justice card. No, anyone who was petty, who was wasting your time, will will be like I don't I don't know. I feel like they may have done this on purpose to you, like or they just didn't take your feelings into consideration. And I feel like that will be dealt with by karma in some way. So again, it feels like when I see this, like they purposely weren't making a decision or, or coming towards you or giving you something you needed. And I just feel like game playing. There was game playing going on with this person, whether you realize it or not. It's like they knowingly kind of left you waiting, left you on the hook. So <clears throat> that'll be taken care of when I get with the justice card. They may have been kind of immature too at times, acting immature. So I'm going to have to get some hot tea. I'm sorry, I'm going to have to cut your reading short. But know that there is someone new for you, Leo, coming in. So I'm going to leave it there, you guys. Have a great week.